terrific night. Thank you so much for supporting the Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame. The 2010 inductees reflect Oklahoma's rich heritage of musical talent. Jean Shepard was born in Paul's Valley and was a pioneer for women in country music. She was the first woman in country music to sell a million records and will celebrate her 55th year in the Grand Old Opry soon. Well, I've been doing what I've been doing for a long, long where, before you was born. <laughs> <laughs> she was also the comic of the group during the media interviews. Despite her fame taking her all over the world, Oklahoma has always been dear to her heart. I have never forgot where I come from cotton fields and the chopping corn in Oklahoma. I'm proud to be an Okie from Muskogee. Les Gillum's career was sparked by visits to his boyhood home by his neighbor Gene Autry. He has recorded 14 albums featuring western swing and country music and has earned many great honors in his long career. And I'm not putting you on this is the greatest honor I could receive because it comes from my own home state. Jimmy Oldecker is a Tulsa native who began playing drums at the age of nine and worked with the greats Bob Seger and Eric Clapton before going on to becoming a founding member of the Tractors. He has earned 24 gold and platinum records. I'm proud to be from Oklahoma and you know, growing up here and, you know, and everyone's support, especially with the uh, Hall of Fame and also the state and, and Tulsa where I grew up. Sam Harris was raised in Sand Springs and became a household name when he won the first ever Star Search. He has sold millions of albums as well as starring on Broadway and on TV. He says singers and songwriters are really at heart just storytellers. And as an artist, all our job is to reflect humanity, is to try to live a good life and reflect humanity. So I try to do that in my work, uh, in my music and outside of it as well. Each year it's obvious from the prestigious inductees that one of our state's hottest commodities is our musical talent.